Today is Black Friday. Um, I did some major damage today. I'm filming this video on the same day because I'm pretty sure that if I wait, I will not film this ever or edit it ever. Um, I still have the same exact outfit I wore last night. I'm sorry for my lack of enthusiasm. I'm running on venti caramel brulee lattes and three hours of sleep. The first place we have here is Bath and Body Works. Um, and I just bought two candles, two for 222. What's Gucci? Mm, okay, so this one is the t called Tis the Season. It looks like this. It has a little snowman on top of it. It smells really good. It kind of smells like Christmas, which is a weird scent, but it also has like a touch of a minty flavor in it. And it just smells really good and I don't really like mint but I like mint chocolate chip ice cream so I was like why not like it and the other candle I got is called winter candy apple which I thought smelled really really good oh this smells amazing it smells like apples candy apples in the winter next from Victoria's Secret I just got some lotions because I really need some lotions and I just got the whole pink fresh and clean uh, lotion set I got the lotion in a little bottle I got the body butter and I love body butter I can't live without body butter it smells so good mmm it just looks like that inside it's like really moisturizing too it's awesome also got the little mini so I can like put it in my car and to school and stuff like that From Sephora they gave me the smallest bag in the entire freaking world that. And we got two things. The first thing I got was the Urban Decay Primer Potion because this is the primer potion I use and I ran out and I need primer potion. And I also got the Beauty Blender, which is something that I've really always wanted to get. So I got this. Awesome. I went to MAC for the first time. But the lipsticks are only $15, so I was like, hmm. The first one I got was the classic Ruby Rue. If it will come out through lipstick looks like this very red and stuff I'll swatch it even though I don't want to no I don't want to swatch it but it's just like a bright red lipstick I got a really dark colored lipstick because I really mainly wanted to go for dark colors um, Maria's makeup XO if you don't know her I'll leave her link to her channel down below she's 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 precious she told me to try cyber by Mac and I tried it in the store and it was so dark. It was weird. Like I felt like my whole face turned like black. But I ended up getting this, which is called Diva, which is like a dark plummy color. I feel like I have a lot of colors that look exactly like this, but that's all right. Next, I went to Target. I got some dry shampoo because I ran out of dry shampoo and I love it. And this is just Tresemme's Fresh Start Dry Shampoo shampoo for volumizing for fine and oily hair. So I got a dark colored lipstick and this is a Maybelline color sensational and it's new. I was like ooh and it's kind of dark. Uh, I don't know I feel like the lighting is throwing it off but this is what it looks like. It's very pretty and dark. I'm really excited to wear this. It is called Deepish Cherry. I just got this fan out from um, um, Target. It's kind of like light colored blue and then dark colored red mixed together. It's in a size extra large because I like, I wanted it to be baggy. I got the best deal on clothes ever. I am so happy. I'm gonna start with my favorite store and weakness ever, which is PacSun. Um, at PacSun, um, their whole store was buy one get one 50% off. Oh my god. And their denim was buy one get one free. Oh my god. If there weren't so many people in PacSun, I would have murdered that freaking store because it's my favorite store and there are so many things that I wanted. The first thing I got was this sweatshirt and it says been it's a Bintrill sweatshirt. It says Bintrill in the front and like blue logos and then on the side here um, it has like the number sign on the sides and in the back it has been chill in the back. I got a crop top from Kendall and Kylie's um, new collection. This is also in a size large and it's really cute. It's kind of like 
It's supposed to be a fitted crop top. I kind of didn't want it to be fitted, but I probably won't be able to help it. Um, but it just has smiley faces all over it. And in the smiley faces, in the eyes, it has skulls. I think this is like the cutest thing ever. And their dining was buy one, get one free. So me and my sister decided to each get a pair. I just got a pair of black jeggings. These are in size, size 11, and they are high rise. I got a flannel jacket it has a hood on it I think this is really cute it's so like vintage and like uh, people hate the word grunge but I love it it's so grunge now I went to cotton on for the very first time and everything in their store was 40% off and I found some really cute stuff I wish I would have stayed there longer to really look but I did get some cute stuff um, I got a couple skater skirts I just got a couple of like skater skirts I got this um, it's kind of like a denim print skater skirt which I've always really wanted like from American Apparel but they're like 40 bucks <laughs> no and then I got a normal black one and I already have a black one but it's always nice to have a second pair and this kind of looks a little bit different it's more pleated than like straight down I just got one of these t-shirts and it was $14.95 plus I got an extra 40% off of this and it kind of looks like something that Brandy Melville would sell like one of their normal tees so I really liked it. It's in a size large because I like them baggy. And the last thing I got was this knit sweater that I got in a size medium. A size large looked way too big but I don't have any black just well I do have a black sweater but it's more thicker material. It's not as soft as this so I just got this black knit. I went to this place called Sirens which I've never been before but it looked really cute in there. Other graphic tops were ten dollars and I really do like graphic tops so I just got this which says, it's a white graphic top that says a Los Angeles, New York. And I have this in tank form, but it kind of got like a hole in it because it's a really crappy fabric. This shirt, which also looks like a brandy shirt, um, like a brandy tank that they have. It's called like the Ying Yang tank or something, but it's in black. I don't know what this barcode thing here right now is about, but whatever. I still think it's really cute. Next, I went to H&M. I really love H&M, but I don't know. I didn't really feel like in the mood to look because I was just so exhausted, but I still wanted to buy more things, but I didn't really look to look. Um, the first thing I got were a pair of tights that I thought were high knee socks, so I was really upset by that, but they're like maroon tights, and I have no idea what to do with this to make them look cuter, because I'm not gonna wear these freaking tights. Next is a Christmas present for my mom. I wasn't sure whether, I originally got it for my mom, like a sauna, I was like, oh my God, that bag's so cute. I can give that for my mom for Christmas. Um, but I don't know if I want to give it to her because it's really cute. I really want to use it. It is this like giant monochrome black bag. It is the cutest thing ever. I love the fact that it's so big. It has like the black like patent, like hard, I don't know what it is. It's like hardish material. Then on the sides, it's like tan, and then it has a strap. I think it's so cute. I think it's something that I could put like my laptop in, and also I can use it as a carry on. Uh, the Forever Twenty One I went to is so big. There's like an upstairs and everything, and I didn't even go upstairs. It's just so overwhelming, and there's so many cute clothes that I want to buy the crap out of everything, but I didn't buy a lot. The first thing I got finally were actual high knee socks, or I don't know if they're high knees. Yeah, they're over the knee socks which I'm really happy I got but they're not like my first choice of color they're a brown color but I'm so happy I could find some over the knee socks I can think of a good way to style them or like what colors to wear with it and everything I just got three other things the first thing I got was actually from the men's section but I thought it was really cute and I love like oversized shirts but it's just like a shirt that has like Mickey Mouse on it and it's really long obviously because it's for guys and it's in a size medium so it's going to be like baggy on me and I think it would look really cute with leggings and some stocks or boots or whatever so I really liked it and I can like fold up the sleeves and stuff. I got another tee. That's because this looks something like exactly like Brandy Melville that I saw on my site and but it's really cute. It's just a pain basic tee with a pocket 
and it goes it's like kind of long which also look really cute with like leggings too and I really really like this the last thing I got was another flannel this was really really cute it's really heavy but it's really cute I love the color it's like a dark green the lighting is kind of throwing it off but it's like a very very dark green color last thing of this video I went to journeys as of course journeys is my home the first thing i got were a pair of vans i tried them on in the store and they looked really really cute i'm really excited to wear these but i just look this they're not white they're black but they have like the white uh sides on it and my laces so and then the very last thing is a pair of doc martens another pair so happy um, the pair I got were these shiny maroon colored ones, which I think are very, very cute. They don't have much of a selection at Journeys, and they don't have like a dock store um, anywhere where I went. But I really wanted the black shiny ones, but they were all out of it in my size. So I was just like, okay, I'll get these. So I just got these shiny maroon ones, and I think they're really cute. They have like really like a uh, marbly detailing on it, and it's shiny as well. And I'm really excited to wear these. So that is everything I got for Black Friday. I'm really happy with everything I got. It's a lot of the things that I wanted. Everything, well, everything I got is what I wanted. I made saved a lot of money on some good things i'm really excited with the stories but thank you guys so much for watching this video i will talk to you or i will see you on wednesday bye